artist Maria Marcer. How does it feel to have your piece here at the BMO Artist Competition? It feels really great. Um, it's really wonderful to be recognized um, for my own artwork so soon after graduating art school. And this is, these, these are very, it's a very unique piece. Tell me a little bit about the materials and the process you use, because I cannot tell how you did this. <laughs> well, um, I use the silkscreen printmaking process. So it's kind of the same process used for putting graphics on t-shirts, and it gives it a very graphic quality. Um, they started with a photo, then I kind of, um, in Photoshop, posterized it, and separated all the layers, and did the whole silkscreen process and printed it in different colors. Um, and eventually, um, it turns out kind of um, graphic, but still photographic as well. Um, and it's on, it's just uh, acrylic ink on kind of a matte plastic sheet. And the color is a very intense green. I don't know, a mixture of sort of a lime green and I, I, I don't know how, how you would describe that green. But what made you choose this color specifically? Um, the colors are representative of the themes that I'm exploring in the piece. Um, kind of the base theme of it is environmental awareness. Uh, so I, obviously the green has that connection with it. Um, yeah, that was on purpose. <laughs> and where was the location that you took the photograph originally? Um, the photos were from Brighton, uh, England. I was doing a printmaking exchange during my final year of school. Yeah. And did you know right away when you saw this that you, you know, it was something that you wanted to explore deeper? Yeah, I saw these little, well, they're boot scrapers. Um, they're kind of in all the old architecture. Um, they're really mysterious. I didn't know what they were when I first saw them. So I asked someone about it and they told me they're boot scrapers. And they all kind of look different. Each of them are unique and they're not used anymore. They're kind of forgotten about and overlooked by most people. So um, I incorporated them into my body of work. So now in this piece, I've targeted them as receptacles for this fictional super seed that I've designed and the idea is that it rebuilds the earth basically when everything's been um, eliminated because of human exploitation. <laughs> and what's the name, what did you say, pit scrapers? Is that right? Boot scrapers. Boot for scraping money boots. <laughs> scraping money boots. I was like, what? Okay, good yeah. to know. Cool. And where is the best place for us to find out more information on you and your art online? Um, I don't have a personal website yet. Um, Maybe the BMO website might have BMO some? The website will probably have the most. If you do a Google search of my name, anything that might have been associated with me will come up. But yeah, I don't. unfortunately don't have a website yet. <laughs> well, thank you so much and congratulations. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm Katie Allman reporting for KD Chats at MoCA in downtown Toronto.